What happened here? Where is everyone? This looks like the work of Beastmen. What? Cowards! There is no time to waste. We have to get to the Priest of Light as soon as possible. Oh, Wendell is in danger. She's your problem and not mine. <laughs> wow. No, thank you. So, is she gonna let us in or what? Oh, and you can help me get to Wendell, by the way. I could use a break. I may not look it, but I'm the heir to the throne of Altana, Princess Angela. My kingdom is full of magicians. But, to be honest, I never got the grasp of spells. I was an embarrassment to the crown. So my mother tried to exchange my life for forbidden magic to release the country's mana stone. <laughs> I mean, who does that? <laughs> I don't even know how I got away. All of a sudden, I was outside the castle. I had no clue what to do, so I wandered through the snow fields, and then I guess I collapsed. After that, I woke up in the town of Arant. A fortune teller there told me to go to Holy City Wendell for answers. So that's basically how I got here. <laughs> oh, how silly of me. I never asked your name. Hawkeye, huh? All right then, lead on, Hawkeye. Give me a moment. I'll get rid of the barrier. There. You should be fine now. Pretty competent for a party of one. Well, as the princess of Altena, I've had training. I'll take monsters over the Altena forces any day. Seems this is a good travel arrangement for all of us. Thanks. 
that for a finishing blow. Potential feels limitless. Wander through these monster dens alone. Got it. I grew up with no parents. But there was one priest in Wendo that was always nice to me. Heath was kind and helpful. He took care of me. My grandpa asked Heath to go to Astoria to look into something for the temple. But I got a really, really bad feeling about it. I didn't want anything to happen to Heath. So I followed him in secret and didn't tell Grandpa when I left the temple that night. By a horrible twist of fate, a creepy-looking man took Heath away right when I finally found him again! <laughs> and then I... I couldn't even get back to Wendell because of the barrier until you opened the path through the cavern for me. I got a little lost on the way and fell down. <laughs> if you hadn't been there, Would have been good night, Charlotte. That was close. <sighs> well, I'm headed toward Wendell to see the Priest of Light anyway. You can follow along for now, 
I guess. Come on. Oh! You want to see Grandpa? Why didn't you say so? You didn't know it, but you helped your chances. I'm actually the granddaughter of the Priest of White. Come on, Swellpoke. I'll take you to my grandpa. Now, it's off to Wendell. Oh, great. I see you're a girl who knows what she wants. If only you were ten years older. I wouldn't mind being one of your recruits. <laughs> Time to work together, everyone! <laughs> I hate to pick on such weak targets, but... <laughs> you wish you'd never cross paths with us. <laughs> on me. This is it. Don't think so. Finally made it to Wendell. Hopefully his eminence knows how to lift curses. Thank you so much for taking me here. Hurry, we need to request an audience with his eminence.
welcome. Lots of wares to browse. I have an eye for quality. of wares to browse. Really mad at me. The hour is late. Please return tomorrow. There's no time. These men have already invaded Chad and Astoria, and they're on their way as we speak. Plus, this fairy won't leave me alone. What? Uh, oh, no. You must report to his eminence at once. Accept the Goddess of Manor's blessings. Your Eminence, what do you know about the Choker of Death? How can I stop the curse? I need to save Jessica. Choker of Death? But that's a forbidden and ancient magic. How did this come to be? Here's the story. I'm certain that Isabella is not what she seems. Hawkeye, my apologies. But I do not know how to lift a curse so ancient and evil. Only the goddess of mana can do that. Only the mana goddess? That can't be. What am I supposed to do now? So you're the priest of light, hmm? Plainer than I expected. I was hoping you might have some wisdom to share. Whoa. Wait! I have something to say. Your Eminence, please listen. I have come from the Sanctuary of Mana to tell you that the Mana Tree is withering. Mana power grows weaker by the day. Withering? But without the mana tree, the seals on the mana stones will break. 
the Benevidons will be released into the world. The uh, what? Uh, come again? You're acting like this doesn't affect you. You've been chosen by Fairy. This means that you alone can retrieve the Sword of Mana from the Sanctuary. I've been what now? She didn't mention that. Hey, Fairy, what's this about? I'm sorry. With the mana in the world so depleted, a fairy can't leave the sanctuary for long without a host. If I hadn't found you, we wouldn't have made it. Yeah, okay. You're welcome and all that, but you're not welcome anymore. Go haunt the old man over there instead, huh? Would that I were able to bear your burden. However, once a fairy finds a host, they are bound to them for their whole life. Only death can part them. Wait one second. I never agreed to this. I don't need a sort of manner or whatever. You want revenge on the person who killed your friend Eagle, and to lift the curse on Jessica, right? The Sword of Mana could break any curse, and it can destroy Isabella. Hey, keep your fairy fingers out of my head. What is the Sword of Mana anyway? The Sword of Mana is the embodiment of the ancient power of mana, guiding force of spirits. It is an alternate form of the Golden Wand used to create the world itself. The one who holds the Mana Sword gains awesome power. The sword lies in the roots of the Mana Tree, waiting. Before the Mana Tree withers completely, must reclaim the sword and awaken the goddess of mana once more. She alone can bring peace to the realm and grant your wish. I could destroy Isabella for what she did to Eagle. <laughs> I'll do anything to save Jessica. So, where can I find this sanctuary of mana exactly? I am so sorry. But with mana so depleted, I don't have enough power to open the portal to the sanctuary, not by myself. Throughout the world are eight points of mana energy, mana stones, sealing away the fearsome Benevidons. If you activate the mana stones, the portal connecting our world to the sanctuary of mana should appear. Through that portal is the sanctuary. However, you should know that the energy inside the eight mana stones was sealed on purpose as the mana goddess began her slumber. So what should I do? In ages past, there once was an ancient spell used to control the energy from the mana stones and bend it to the user's will. However, countries refused to allow each other any control of the spell and use of the mana stones. The war that followed caused unspeakable damage. It was nearly as destructive as the sealed Benevidons. The survivors cursed the magic to avoid future tragedy and forbade anyone from using it. Now the life of any person who uses the spell will be forfeit. There is no longer anyone alive who knows how to work this cursed spell. Guess that's it then. There may be one way borrow the powers of the elemental spirits that reside near the mana stones instead, I can combine their powers with what remains of mine to open the portal for everyone. Splendid! This is a relief. 
If you wish to find a Mana Stone, I've heard many say that the Lightstone is in Cascade Cavern, guarded by the Elemental Lumina. It is the cavern you pass through in order to reach here. Take Fairy. With what remains of her power, she can help you find Lumina in the cavern. See if you may borrow his light powers. So, wait. The Sword of Mana? Huh. I think my mother mentioned that thing. But if I can get it before her, I can show her that I'm not powerless. She might even let me come back. Hey, take me with you. Please, come on. Certainly. And the more elementals we meet, the more magic you can learn yourself. Really? That's perfect. Wait, stop! 
hole? Further up. I bet Lumina is in there. Gotta get this nuisance out of the way before we can go. Doors? Doors? Too bad. All done. this for Jessica's sake. was talking about, right? How are we supposed to get over there? Oh, right. I forgot you can't fly. I think I can use the residual mana power in the waterfall to get you over there. Hmm. Let's give it a try. Wait, 
potential feels limitless. we're looking for. It's a giant monster. So why do I feel mana power coming off of it? Mana? Oh, this isn't a normal monster, is it? It doesn't matter. We need to take care of this first, right? Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> 
is that? Hey yo! Looking for Lumina? That'd be me! Nice to meet ya! A pleasure! And thanks for releasing me from the belly of that full metal meanie, am I right? <sighs> Who knows what would have happened if you hadn't come? <sighs> Barry filled me in on your plight while you were fighting. Telepathy's great, huh? Just like Barry, we elementals need mana to live. I'll help however I can to make sure we save the mana of the world. Lumina, where is the Lightstone? It's straight up from here, deep within the old ruins. But you can't exactly get there from here. Oh, no, 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 no. It's safe, though. For now, at least. It's so unstable. It seems like the Benevodon could be unsealed at any minute. We gotta get the rest of the elementals on board and open the portal to the sanctuary! Huh? Look at that! A shortcut! for taking down the cavern barrier. Saved us some trouble. <laughs> now, nothing's stopping us from invading Wendell. This is a present to show our appreciation. No! <laughs> Let's get going.
Oh, what do I do? 